Hi, hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, I am going to solve the second challenge in Data Cloud in Flows module. And the name of the challenge is Access Data Cloud from Flows. To start this challenge, we need to launch the playground. For that reason, here click on this launch button. Then you will be redirected to this page. So let's see the instructions first. For that, move to your trailhead. And here just scroll down to the last. So from here we need to complete this challenge and here in this challenge we will create a record trigger flow. For that move to your playground and here click on this app launcher and search for flows. So here it is click on that and here click on this new button. So in this flow type select it as record trigger flow and select the object as guest review. And here leave it as it is and for the condition requirement select it as all conditions are met and and also search for the field as rating value and select the operator as less than or equal and also type the value as 4. After that leave this as it is actions and related records and also here click on this toggle near to the add asynchronous path. After that, here click on this cross icon at the top. Then, we need to create a text variable. So, here copy the API name. So, you need to copy this API name correctly. After that, move to your flow and here click on this toggle. And here click on this new resource. And select the resource type as variable. And also paste the API name here and select the data type as text and then click on this done button. So like this we successfully created the variable guest loyalty level. Then we will check the next instruction so move to the trailhead. So in this run asynchronous path we need to create a get records element. So copy the label that is get contact and then move to the flow and here click on this plus icon and search for the element as get records select it and then paste the label here and also here select the salesforce object as contact after that here search for the field as contact id and leave the operator as equals and for the value select it as triggering guest review and in that select it as contact so you need to select all of these correctly after selecting these just click on the cross icon at the top then we will check the next instruction that is we need to create a get external loyalty label element so copy the label here and move to the flow and here click on this plus icon and search for the element as get records and here paste the label and also from this data source select it as data cloud object and here from this data space select it as default and for the object select it as external guest loyalty home so here it is after that just scroll down and here in this field search for guest id after that leave the operator as equals and for the value select it as contact from get contact and in that select the external id and also just scroll down and here in this how to store record data select it as choose fields and assign variables the third option and here click on this in separate variables and here search for the field as loyalty level and also for the variable select it as guest loyalty level. So after adding all of these details correctly here just click on the cross icon at the top. Then we will see the next instruction and the next instruction is about we need to add a decision element. So copy the label here that is check loyalty level and move to the flow. Here click on this plus icon and select the element as decision. And here paste the label and also we need to copy the outcome label as well. So move to the trailhead and here copy the label as gold or higher. 
and here in this condition requirement change this to any condition is met or and here in this resource search for guest loyalty level and leave the operator as equals and copy the value from the instructions that is gold and then paste it here and here click on this add condition and again search for the resource as guest loyalty level and leave the operator as equals and copy the value from the instruction that is platinum and then paste it here then here click on this default outcome and copy the label from the instruction that is silver or lower and then paste it here just replace this default outcome to silver or lower so if you add all of these correctly here just click on this cross icon at the top so let's see the next instruction that is we need to add a get records element in the gold or higher path so copy the label that is get experience and then move to the flow here click on this plus icon and search for the element as get records and then paste the label here and also here in this object select it as experience and here in this condition search for the field as record id and leave the operator as equals and for the value select it as triggering guest review and in that search for experience so here it is select that so after adding these details just click on the cross symbol at the top then we will see the next instruction that is we need to create a text template so copy the api name so move to the flow and here click on this toggle and then you will get this so here click on this new resource and select the resource type as text template and then paste the api name here and also change this from view as rich text to view as plain text so here click on this insert a resource and select this contact from get contact and in that select it as full name so just scroll down and then search for full name so here it is click on that then you can see that get contact dot name is added so here just remove this and then again search for the resource as guest loyalty level and again click on this insert your resource and now search for this experience from get experience and in that search for experience name so here it is click on that and here just remove this and then we need to add the reviews rating so for that search for review so here it is triggering guest review and in that select it as rating value so here it is after that just remove this text from the insert a resource and then again search for triggering review triggering get review and in that search for comments after that just remove this from this insert a resource so i will add all of this body in the comments and also in the description do copy from there or else you can insert the resource from here as well so after adding all of these just click on this done button then we will check the next instruction that is we need to create a formula field as well so copy this api name that is three days away and move to the flow here click on this new resource and select the resource type as formula and then paste the api name here and also select this data type as date and then copy the formula from the instructions that is today plus 3 then paste it here and here click on this check syntax button so we can see that the formula that we added is valid so here click on this done button then we will check the next instruction that we need to add here create records element so copy the label that is create task and then move to the flow here click on this plus icon and search for the element as create records click on that and here paste the label and also from this select it as manually and search for the object as task 
and here just scroll down and search for the field as due date only and for the value select it as three days away again click on this add field and now search for the field as description and for the value select it as task body again click add field and now search for the field as assigned to id and for the value select it as experience from get experience so here it is and in that select it as owner id after that again click on this add field and now search the field as priority and for the value select it as high so here it is high again click add field and now search for the field as status and for the value select it as not started and again click add field and search for the field as subject and copy the value from the instructions that is low score review from high value guest minus get contact name just paste the value here and then click on this add field and now search for the field as related to id and for the value select it as experience from get experience and in that select it as record id after that finally click on this add field and search for the field as name id and for the value select it as contact from get contact and in that select it as contact id so like this you need to select all of these fields and the values correctly then only you won't get any error after adding all of these correctly just click on this cross symbol at the top and let's see the next instruction so we need to save the flow finally so copy the flow label and here move to the flow and click on this save button and paste the flow label here and then click on the save button so we can see that the last saved status is available here so we successfully completed the second challenge so move to the instruction space and here click on this check challenge button so yeah the assessment is completed and i got the 500 points please do check out our channel education matters for next module answer and also Please do share our channel to your friends. It will help them too. That's it. Thank you.